so in this video lecture <coughs> we are going to discuss about geothermal power plant geothermal power plant also known as geothermal energy is comes under the topic of power plant this topic of power plant comes under applied thermodynamics geothermal energy is a heat derived within the surface of earth which is shown in the diagram the diagram consists of some of the main parts including control separator steam drum turbine which is connected to a generator and the generator which actually produces electric power then the turbine steam turbine the exhaust of remaining steam with low pressure which goes to the condenser in the condenser condenser condenses it then after condensation that goes to the pump and that pump condenses steam into the earth crust the earth crust so below the earth crust there is underground steam storage how it works from the underground steam storage the steam which is taken out with help of the control then that steam separates separates then it goes to the steam drum after the separation steam drum that will help of the steam steam turbine runs when the when once the steam turbine works or it runs as the generator is coupled with the generator there is electric power generation and then the low pressure steam goes to the condenser that everything shown in the diagram next water and or steam carry the geothermal energy to the earth surface depending on its characteristics geothermal energy can be used for heating and cooling purposes or be harnessed to generate clean electricity geothermal energy is thermal energy generated and stored in the earth geothermal energy has been used used for thousand of years in some countries for cooking and heating the earth has got molten interiors as this points water gets converted into steam and comes out with force these are natural geothermal power plants the figure the figure which shows a typical natural geothermal power plant here steam coming out from the geothermal well drives the turbine which in turn drives the generator the steam after expansion in turbine gets condensed in condenser the condensate is again admitted to the admitted to the geothermal well like how this cycle is goes on in all geothermal power plant or geothermal energy is a clean energy it have no pollution and it can be get free of cost from the earth cost so it has having so many advantage and uh, this is 
a clean energy once you harness the energy that can be stored so what it is important in this geothermal power plant is uh, the parts like the control the separator the steam drum the steam turbine the steam turbine which is connected to the generator and after the work is done by the turbine the exhaust steam which goes to the condenser the condenser after supplying the cooling water to the condenser condenser condenses it then that condense goes to the pump and that pump again gives the condensed steam to the earth crust so that is all about the geothermal power plant thank you